There are a few things to know before you order. If you cannot make your opening at least 14 and 1 quarter inches wide, these cabinets will likely not work very well for you. Um, the plastic trim that goes around the outside edge does add just a little bit of width to the box and it makes it a lot easier to get in the opening if you have at least 14 and a quarter inches of width. You will need a minimum of 3 and 3 quarter inches of unobstructed depth inside your wall. The cabinet box itself is three and three quarter inches going into the wall. The model numbers will tell you what the height of the box portion going in the wall is. So for instance, if the model number ends in 18, the box is 18 inches high. Or if it ends in 44, the box is 44 inches high. That does not mean that it's the same height as the door itself. Your door is larger than the box because it has to cover the plastic frame. So. If you have an 18 inch box like this one is, your overall measurement is actually an inch and a half taller than that. It's 19 and a half. If you order the white enamel box like this one, all you'll need to do is hinge the door on whatever side you want. It is reversible because we do not drill it for the knob. There is only one screw per hinge And then you put the little cover plate onto the hinge and it's done. As far as installation goes, there's only four screws that hold it in the wall.